I just wanted to get a dialogue going about gender roles and nostalgia, family ties. In those days, it was a, uh, a sexist well, job. Wrinkle free. Do you remember using spray starch though? You dampen things and roll them up. Did your mother do any ironing? I don't remember mom ever complaining about the ironing. Hi girls, we brought our ironing. <laughs> You put it. <laughs> there you go. If I want my clothes looking fresh, clean, and perfectly pressed, nothing beats an iron. When we need our clothes to look their best, we're still using iron. I'm going to share with you some of my best ironing tips. I'm ironing my mother-in-law's aprons. You're doing a wonderful job. Thank you. Your mother-in-law likes you now. to come to see someone iron. He said, oh no, just put cold water on it right away. My mother ironed when I was growing up, but my mother's 92 now, and she couldn't be less interested in ironing anymore. I think she feels very liberated. Isn't that the truth? Yeah. I was the only girl, so guess oh. what? Oh. My job was to iron my brother's shirt. Oh, I bet that made you oh, happy. So they could go out on their dates. Yes. <laughs> I remember sprinkling them and putting them in plastic bags in the fridge. Moisture. Yeah. Yeah. How did they pass on all these little hints? There was no internet. I was thinking about the fact of how proud I am that our daughter was four before she knew what an iron was. And my mother-in-law was not happy with that. I was a radical because she wanted me to be an ironer an instead ironer. of a lawyer. <laughs> Why did you put them in the refrigerator? He had to roll them up so they wouldn't mold. Oh my gosh. Yeah, this, this is amazing. Isn't ironing a good time to kind of reminisce? The only thing that I'm missing here to be doing this is I need a cigar. 